Hey everyone, it's Analia and I'm here today with another review. Um, today I will be reviewing Soak Your Balls Bath Bombs for Men. Um, I did do another review about some other bath bombs for men. Um, however, these are different. Um, the last review that I did for Bath Bombs for Men was uh, from Natural Essence. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and just get started on this. First of all, the box is so funny. Soak your balls. I think it's very fitting for men. Um, <laughs> and then uh, on the back, it tells you the different scents of the six different bath bombs. It gives you the ingredients. It gives you directions and a warning. <laughs> So yeah, I'm just going to open um, one of these up and show you guys. I have my uh, bowl of water to show you guys, you know, how it fizzes and stuff. I've already used a few and I was pretty, you know, well, my husband used a few and uh, was pretty happy with them. So they all smell so good. and. You know, they come in this cute box, and they're all labeled, so you can tell um, which one is which. This is what they look like in the box. Um, and today I'm going to be showing you the cinnamon one, because I'm not um, a real big fan of like a cinnamon scent so this is the one i'll be opening to show you guys um of course you know the plastic on here is tightly wrapped on purpose to keep the bath bomb uh, intact and then you just kind of cut it a little bit just to get um it open all bath bombs are a little bit difficult to open, but that's okay. Alright, so I have it open, and I'm just going to move my bowl of water um, where you can see it. Right now I'm just going to show you guys, like, you can't break it. It's not, it's not fragile. It's not going to fall apart before you get it in the bath. Um, so that's, that's really something that kind of important to me because like whenever you have a bath bomb, uh, it should stay intact. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to put it in the water now and let you guys see how it does. Okay guys, so it's been fizzing for a minute now. Um, it's... Still pretty good size. It hasn't gotten too small too quickly. Um, I also really like how it's uh, making the like foam on top of the water. Some bath bombs don't really foam up, so I really do like that. I don't really smell the cinnamon smell. Um, I picked cinnamon to show you it, to show you guys because I don't really like the smell of cinnamon. But to me, this one does not really smell like cinnamon that much, um, which is for me better because I don't really like the smell of cinnamon. I love the color that it's giving the water. I really love um, when you get bath bombs that they change the color of the water. It kind of, like, to me, it's, like, relaxing. It sets, like, a, a vibe. It sets a mood, uh, you know. So when you're really trying to relax and you're really trying to, like, let go of whatever kind of energy you have that you want to let go of, um, I think that the cut, the changing of the color of the water uh, is something that I like to, to kind of, like, let go of that vibe. 
So like if I was upset, um, you know, I think I would use the red, a red bath bomb. Well, it's more orangey, but you know. So I really like them. They're really working very well. I just want to show you guys this right here. <laughs> you see how the bath bomb is just like rolling around in there. So I really enjoy that. It's just like moving around. And it's fizzing up like so much. So I can imagine like if it was actually in a big bathtub that it would fizz up quite well. Yeah, I really don't have much to say about these bath bombs other than they they work really well. They smell so good, especially for guys, you know, they don't want something that's like girly smelling and they smell so good. Now, these bath bombs are different than the natural essence bath bombs because the natural essence bath bombs, as soon as you put them this close to your face, you could smell them. Now these, they're not as strong scented as the natural essence bath bombs. So if you like a stronger scent, I would suggest going with the natural essence bath bombs compared to the soak your balls bath bombs. But if you like something that is, um, you know, not as strong smelling, not as uh, potent, then I would pick um, the soak your balls bath bombs I really do like them I think my husband would like them more because well actually I don't know I don't know how he feels about the smell if he likes more smell or if he likes less smell um, but to me I like them either way a lot of smell or a little bit of smell is the same for me there's that bath bomb just rolling around in there if you can see it I also like how this bath bomb um, stays at the top of the water instead of sinking down to the bottom. Um, I really, I, I like that it's on top of the water instead of sinking to the bottom because when they sink down to the bottom, you know, then you're in the bath and it's like underneath your legs and underneath your butt and stuff. <laughs> and it's not very comfortable. Um, but this one, it just stays right on top of the water so you don't have to uh, worry about that at all. So it's been about 10 minutes and it's probably half the size, I would say. It's shrunk about half the size, I would say, to when you, when you originally put it in the bath. Oh, I can smell the cinnamon now. It's still not very strong. It does smell good, but it's not like, um, like very, very strong. So I like that about these. Okay guys, so I would say for me, this product gets a nine out of 10, just because the bath bombs are not as um, strongly scented as the natural essence bath bombs. Um, so I would pick the natural essence bath bombs over these bath bombs, but I still love them. The quality is still great. Um, I, I actually, you know what? I actually think that I would actually pick these bath bombs compared to the natural essence bath bombs because these bath bombs stay on the top of the water and that is a bigger factor for me than the smell. Um, Cause these do still have great smell. They just, um, don't smell as strong, but I really love that they stay on top of the water. 
um, because yeah, when you're in the bath, you don't really want something, you know, rolling around down there. Um, so yeah, I would give this product then a 10 out of 10 because I love everything about it. All right, guys, I'll see you next video. Um, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If there's anything that you want me to review, let me know in the comments below. Or if you didn't like this video, give it a thumbs down. Um, leave me some comments. Uh, let me know how I'm doing or if there's anything you would like to see me review. Um, yeah, and I'll catch you guys on the next video.